switch is unmuted. There we go. Making sure all my connections are in, which they are. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of Slime Ranchers. Now, in today's, or in last week's episode, we got tier 13 of the rewards club. So if we go in here and look at our rewards club, as you can see, level 13. The next level, which is 14, is at 15 thousand coins um so it's gonna take a while um going along with the theme from the past couple weeks of a new color scheme every video i don't think we've done grape shot yet so let's do grape shot because it looks cool um, so I think today we're really just gonna try and do what we've been doing the last episode. And just get as many coins as possible while I talk about things. So this video is pre-recorded. Again, you know, you know me in pre-recording Tuesday's videos. Um, but this video is pre-recorded because it is the first day back at school after spring break and it's in person so i don't necessarily have time between classes or when my dad's out exercising or something to record um so i'm doing it now on a sunday so that way when tuesday rolls around we don't necessarily have to worry about you know do I have a video up? Do I not have a video up? You know, what's the status on it? Stuff like that. We just won't have to worry about it. I'm completely taking it out of the equation. It's great. Um, so, yeah. There are a couple of things that I want to talk about. Why did I say about in that way? We'll never know. Um... I need to change the status on that. No. There we go. Um, speaking of status, um, I was doing some research on some good task management systems because, again, for school, like I mentioned in Sunday's video, I haven't been doing too hot in it lately. Um, Partially because of some bad habits that were gotten into, um, and just some things I was doing wrong in all my subjects all across the board. Um, so, I have put systems in place to fix those things, just like the focus app that I use, um, and the focus music. But I realized Apple Reminders and just going by the sheer amount of assignments on my Canvas page might not be the best system for trying to do this. It might not be the best way. Um, because then if I'm in the middle of something, I still can't cross it off. You know, stuff like that. So I went, did some research, and I stumbled. This is not sponsored, by the way. Um, I stumbled upon a service called Monday.com, um, and I got a free account, and it works really well. I've got stuff set up for school, and I've got a content creator page hooked up. I've got each of my YouTube series, and then um, a bunch of my TikTok series on there as well. So that, in the end, I can fully utilize, hopefully at least, fully utilize this um, service. I think it's going to be really helpful. Also, as I mentioned in Sunday's video, I moved my workspace from the multi-purpose room downstairs, or at least here at my mom's, from the multi-purpose room downstairs into my TV room. Um, now, the TV room is called the TV room because it has a TV in it. 
That was a slight mini game of how many times can I say TV in the same sentence. Um, but that does mean. But um, that does mean I could potentially use it as a second monitor. Um, no, 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 it does not mean that because it is a 42-inch TV. Yes, you heard me right. 42. It's a great TV, but if I move it down, it's going to be too much of a um, hassle to try and work with. Because I'm going to have to... Like, I have to move my head for the coordinates of a 27. 42 is not double, but nearly double that. So I'd have to, like, crane my neck to look up at the top corners, and I don't want to have to do that while on a Zoom call and have the teachers think I'm not focusing or something. Um, but I did find a use for it, which is that, you know, when school starts back up, I'll be able to look at my Canvas calendar and hopefully import things. It doesn't have an auto-importer. And hopefully import things into my school calendar to be able to do the things that I need to do with, um, to be able to do the things that I need to do for school. That's the word I was looking for. Um, but my use for a TV in there is going to be, I'm going to screencast my Mac to it, and essentially just have that be a giant list of everything I need. Um, because it's great to have that sort of list. Um, it's great to have a list up there, and I'm hoping that through doing that, and the best thing about, um, Monday.com is that, um, it has a status option. So, for the creator page, the status options are idea to be filmed, filming, filmed, editing, rendering, uploading, and uploading. That was the ones that I put in. The default ones are things along the lines of um, scripting, editing, approved, recording, stuff like that, or uploading or uploaded. Stuff like that. Um, and while yes, I do feel like those terms would be helpful, I feel like the ones that I put in place would be a little bit more helpful because, as you guys know, I don't script my videos. Unless it's like an educational thing, or unless it's for a school thing, in which case I'll figure something out because I have only had one video rendering project for school where I've actually needed to script things. Um, yeah. Well, okay, maybe three, but one of them was a big project that was 50-something points. The other one was a mini-project that was like, I don't know, 10 points. I tend to take the 50-point ones way more seriously. No. Uh, Quantum Plort. Get back here. There you go. So, um, you know, I'm really hoping it does help with the organization of this channel. I also knew since I was going to be on vacation and pre-recording literally like two to three weeks of videos at a time that I was going to need a little bit of organization to be able to really make it work. How are these guys doing food-wise? Still plenty. Alright. Um, I definitely knew I was going to need some systems in place to help with organization. The best thing about this is it also comes with a phone app 
as well. I know it really sounds like it's sponsored, but trust me, it, it's not. Um, but it comes with a phone app, and I'm really looking forward to using it. Um, yeah. I am genuinely looking forward to using it. Um, but I will let you guys know how this stuff works out. I lost my train of thought there for a second. Hopefully it wasn't too obvious. Um, but I will definitely let you guys know in Thursday's video and onward whether I like the system or not. Um, it might be a sort of complicated answer. It might not be. I really, really do not know whether I'm going to love it or hate it or what. Um, so, you know, it's going to be what it's going to be. Like, I'm either going to really like it or really not like it. So, we'll see, is what I'm saying. Um, but definitely expect a couple of TikToks going through my, um, going through my pass-through setup over here. Expect that, like, Thursday night or Friday. Um, I'm gonna do some work on it later today. It is 5.04 p.m. as I'm recording this. I'm gonna set my, I'm gonna, like, render and stuff, and then... I'm going to move my laptop from gaming setup to work setup to do some work because I've got to do some research for vacation. I've also got to study a little bit for physics. Not that I have a test or anything, just so that what we learned right before break doesn't escape me. If that makes any sense. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping that this is going to be a good organization tool for me now and for me in the future because organization is definitely something that I need. Um, it is definitely... Ooh, are we... Yes, we are. Okay. Um, it is definitely something that I have struggled with in the past. And it's something that I still struggle with. If any of you have seen the state of my desk, you'll understand that. Um, it's not really that bad. I'm over-exaggerating. Only half, though. Um, but I am really hoping that this helps in the future. Um, I don't really know what else there is. At some point, I do have to go through the list and figure some stuff out um, about how I'm going to do certain things, certain things like um, I've got a bunch of TikTok drafts that I need to import so that I can update the status on them. Um, and stuff like that. Not any bad work per se, although it depends on how you find that. But not any bad things that I'm going to have to figure out, just logistical things. Um, but I also am really looking forward to working in my room again, even if it's not at my, you know, really, really nice gaming setup. Speaking of gaming setups, um, I don't show my setup a lot on here. I talk about it a lot, but I don't show it a lot. Um, there is not a lot of RGB involved in it. The only thing RGB is my keyboard. Literally, that's it. I've seen ads for, like, these RGB mouse pads and stuff. Um, and I don't have any source of income, so I can't buy them. It's always my parents buying them for me. Same with, like, the boom mic and stuff. But, um, you know... We'll see how the summer goes. I may end up with like a part-time job or something, or you know, stuff like that. So, you know, I want to see how that goes. But at some point, I might see if I can get up enough money to buy one of those. 
because they look really, really cool, and I think it would highly benefit the way that my setup looks. Not that that matters in any way, shape, or form, but it would also let me use the mouse pad that I'm currently using over at my work desk to get a little bit better DPI. Again, not that that matters. Um, at some point, I do want to build a new PC, but again, I don't have the budget for that because that's like an $800 thing. And on top of that, we just bought my $1400 MacBook, so I don't need a new PC. It's just a question of do I want one, which I do. But again, I don't have the budget for it, and I'm not going to make my parents spend that kind of money. Um, so, you know, stuff like that. But at the time of recording, we are still at 150 followers on TikTok, which again, is not, a, not 150, 250 followers on TikTok, which is not a bad thing at all. That is a good number. To be at 100, not 100, 250 is insane. Now there's a part of me that really wants that 1,000. And I don't think we're gonna get that 1,000 that quick. Um, you know, I'm hoping that we can reach 300 by summer, but at the rate we're going, we might not. Um, so we shall see going to be interesting for TikTok, especially now that I have this new, um, not necessarily time management, but this new organizational tool. Um, it'll be interesting to see how things benefit. So as soon as I finish putting these in here, I'm going to put half of these in here, get a good amount. We're going to sleep until morning and then end the video here. Ooh, alright, they're already good, so I'm going to replenish them. Gonna grab these, gonna grab these. Wrong way. Wrong way again. That was the right way, just not where I was trying to go. I was trying to make it to here because we've got floors for these guys to pick up. Puddle slime's back. We can go sell these guys and then sleep until morning. And then I'm gonna have to end the video off. And I'll take that guy because I don't know where the thing is. I know where it is in the grotto, so maybe we'll take a trip down to the grotto to figure that out. Ooh, and we are over 10,000 coins, which means in the next episode, I think we'll be able to actually get 15,000. So that'll be good. See, here's the Deckerizer. So let's see, we can do that. Alright, nice. So now let's head back, let's sleep until morning. Um, a lot of the goal of this game now is going to be... Sort of, ooh, right, pogo fruits. That's the other thing we need to do, and then we can sleep until morning. The other goal of this game now is going to be trying to get um, this rewards club maxed out, because it maxes out at level 28, so we're almost halfway there. Which is pretty darn good. But nonetheless, that still leaves a bunch of... Um... Oh, what's the word for it? That still leaves 14 tiers left to go. Um, so... Not ideal, but not bad. That's where the Deckerizer is. 
Alright, let's sleep until morning, and then I will end off the video. Return to ranch. Alright, so guys, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave it a thumbs up. If you're new, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye.